Uh, welcome to another question for the pure and applied calculator and shortcuts. Now, in this aspect, we'll be dealing with how the structure of the question on that trigonometry. Now, see this question. The question says if tan theta is equal to 3 over 4, find cos square theta. Now, in this aspect, the only thing you need to do is make this theta dissolving formula. So, if you want to make the theta dissolving formula, on the calculator, you know, your theta here will be tan inverse of your 3 over 4. So, if you want to press this on the calculator, you are going to press shift tan. You press shift tan. So, if you press shift tan, it's going to bring something like this for you. So, when you press that, press your fracture button. When you press fracture button, then press 3 at the numerator. Then press, come to your denominator, press 4. Then close the bracket. Come to the this place and close the bracket. Now, when you close the bracket, press equals to. When you press equals to, you observe that your answer is 36.8 something. I don't care because of the structure of the question. The reason why I don't care is because I can use answer straight. So now, press AC. Now, once we press our AC, don't forget the last operation, the answer is still the answer at the down button of your calculator. So we now go to the question. The question says find cos square theta. So now press cos. We now press cos. You now press your answer button underneath. When you press answer button, close the bracket. Don't forget it is cos square theta. So it's like the value we got initially, which is our value of the theta, is our answer here. So after you close the bracket, square it. The press equals to. You observe that the answer here is 16 over 25. And this is it, 16 over 25. I believe if you are given any structure of a question like this, even if you are given a question like this, if tan theta is equal to A over B, don't worry, if I have time, I'll still do something like this. Then you can make this option A to be 1. You can make, sorry, you can make A to be 1 and make B to be what? To be 2. That shows that you, you make your tan theta to be what? Tan inverse of 1 over 2. And your theta will be the answer you get. So please, with this format, whenever you are given any question like this, just make sure that you make theta dissolving formula on your calculator, then insert the value straight in the question. And with that, we are good to go, as you can see the way we did. So please and please, in our next video, I'm expecting more comments so that it should trigger us to the next aspects we need. I mean, you need, because we follow what our student needs. So tell us what you need and what you need right now that can help you so that we can bring it up in our next video. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Just like, comment, share for others. And God bless you.